Hey folks, we're back. I hope things are going well for you. I'm Don. This is Rockin' a Country. Uh, the, you know what? I haven't said this in a long time, but the impetus for the name of the channel was that I went from being a rock guy, guy who loved rock, you know, British rock, Southern rock, and all that, and punk rock when it came out, The Clash, of course. Then much later in life, I got into country. It was Nashville country. And then when I started the channel, I was doing reactions to Nashville country. And then you guys were like, Don, the way you like lyrics, you've got to start doing traditional country. Here's an artist. Here's a song. Here's a this. And I fell in love pretty quickly. I'm like, oh, a traditional country tells a story. There's a succinctness in the language. You get three or four minutes to tell some kind of story, and they tell it. And that economy of words was just brilliant to me. And then when you add steel and fiddle and the instrumentation, you've got all that. But Kevin Bounds made a donation request for me to do one of his own songs. And I did, Kevin, I guess it was about three weeks ago, I posted the first reaction to a donation request you made for one of your songs. Then you began requesting other artists. But first, thank you for the donation, of course. Those of you who have been reaching out to me, the information, the PayPal link is in the description box below. You just click on it and ballpark figures, 25 bucks. That's just so that you know how it works. But anyway, Kevin requested that I do his acoustic version of Just a Touch of You. So that's what I'm going to be doing. So let's see, Kevin, what you got for me this time. Just a Touch of You. I've got pictures on the wall To fill that empty space Got new carpet down the hall And all the chairs are in place I've got everything I need Make this place look brand new uh, Seems the only thing that's missing Yeah Is just a touch of you Before Kevin gets going, I'm going to say I can relate to this If it goes where I think it is Relationship broke up, now he's in his own place now, we guys, we figure a few things out along life's path about what goes with what. I guess you don't put paisley with polka dots over there or something like that, but women just are way better at this, by and large, than we guys are. But let's see what the touch of her winds up being. It's going to be beyond what pillows go with what uh, lampshades or something. Just a touch of you. Feel just right over here nice. Just a little of your smile Could change the atmosphere You gotta make her smile I've tried everything I know But nothing seems to do All I really need is just a touch of you. Had a little flare of George Jones there. I still think about your kisses and the arms that held me. And the way that we made love Until the morning light Now there's an aching deep inside me That just won't turn me loose Things around here are really hurting yes. for 
just a touch of you. Nice delivery. Just a touch of you would feel just right over here. Just a little of your smile could change the atmosphere. I don't want to lose this thought. I really like the open-endedness of just a touch of you would look good over here. And of course, as a listener of a song, you've got no idea where he's talking about. And that's the point. Just the listener isn't pigeonholed into a place over on the other side of the couch or a little touch in the kitchen or this thing in the bedroom or wherever it might be. It was just, just over here. So you're inside his head. Right, he's not taking you into yours. You're inside his head, and that's really good songwriting. I've tried everything I know, but nothing seems to do. Georgie again. All I really need is just a touch of you. Double entendre, nice. All that my heart needs is just a touch of you. That was really good, Kevin. And I mean, I like that song a lot. I won't just address this to you, Kevin, even though it was a donation request, but I'll make my, my comments. But acoustic, I love acoustic when it's done well. And so often, how do you say, like unpolished artists sound one dimensional when they do acoustic. And it takes a lot more to be simple than it does to be complex. Like when my ex and I, you know, she was a dancer, so we owned dance studios. And she explained to me and that she used to have to explain and the teachers used to have to explain because it was a high level dance school and, you know, very serious training. And they'd have to explain to the dancers when they got to an appropriate age that moving slowly is much more difficult on stage than moving quickly because when you move quickly, whether you're at a competition or in a performance, people don't pick up on your mistakes. Moving slowly across a stage is much more difficult. Everything you're doing is seen, it's felt, it's observed, it's imbibed. You just pick up on it. And it takes more confidence, it takes, takes more practice, it takes more polish to have a stage presence when moving slowly. and. Acoustic to me is reminiscent or it parallels that where there's not a lot going on. You can't, nothing's covered up by, you know, guitar licks or the drummer or the fiddle or steel or anything. Nothing else is brought in. It's just you and that guitar. So you've won. You've got to be good on the guitar and you have to have a feel for the guitar so that the way you're playing it matches the lyrical content of what you're saying. And then your voice has to reflect the lyrical content. And those two have to marry one another. And so you did at least a two-dimensional job here versus the one-dimensionality that is so prevalent or present in things that I hear. But not on the channel because you folks request like amazing stuff. That's why the ratings are all like eights and aboves because you don't request songs that suck. But that was really nice. I like the open-endedness. I have a feeling this happened to you, Kevin, this story here. But you have a sensitivity in this song. But I have a feeling that this happened, happened to you because it was way too on the nose. Somebody else could have provided it to you. A friend or another songwriter, of course, could have, could have written that and you adopted it for your own. But the way you sang it suggests to me that you could relate to this way too well. And not in a whiny way. It wasn't sung in a whiny way. It was sung appropriately emotionally, but you weren't selling anything. And I appreciate that. Nothing. I. It's hard not to overdo something. It really is because I, I just the tendency is, especially for me, to be hyperbolic in ways and just. But in artistry, it it can be difficult because you really want to get that message across. And you know you're going to be playing this in concert live. You know it's going to be your recording. And you, people are going to hear it in different ways. 
And in your mind, as you're in the studio, it might be hold, hard to hold back. But you did this. This is very professionally done. It's very well done. And it was beautiful. I could relate to it. I could relate to it because it's basically my life right now. Not that I'm pining for my ex. I'm not that at all. But I also like the double entendre. It isn't just the touch of a woman in the home and how it's set up and decorated and stuff. It's her physical touch. I mean, you mentioned making love all through the night, which is very impressive. Um, but you mentioned holding, you know, her the way she held you, and that's a different type of touch. And then in the end, I think you brought it in. I think you used the word heart in one of the lines where the emotional content of it. So, oh, I got to rate this. God, I get so wrapped up thinking about things. It's actually a miracle that I even remember to, to rate the songs. And so for me, this is another one that comes in at an even nine. I think that's what I did on Brie Bagwell's song and this as well. Very different songs, very different presentations. But this comes in, it was just very well presented, very well done. So I love how many good artists are out there. And I love connecting with you folks too. And I love that the folks on the channel are also being exposed and interacting. You can go to your channel and see what else you've got and download your songs if they want and, and this kind of thing to support you. So, okay, folks, there it is. Kevin Bounds, Just a Touch of You, acoustic version 9.0. So that goes in the playlist of songs of nine and above. There it is, folks. Have a great day. I'll see you on another video. Keep rocking to country. Mm -hmm.